Hey, good morning, intermediate algebra students. Um, today we only have one con to do, and this one actually is not very difficult. Um, I normally would have two, but tomorrow you have a quiz coming up, and I don't like putting a quiz on the same day as the Khan Academy assignment. So uh, it's your lucky day. You only got one to do. So here is what you got today. <clears throat> They're going to give you two equations, equations A and B for this reasoning one. And you have to figure out what did they do to get from equation A to equation B. <coughs> if you look, <coughs> excuse me, I'm going to get a drink of water here, okay? Uh, all right, hopefully I can talk better now. You can see to get from A to B, they added an X to both sides. So this part here where I'm clicking right there, that's the part I put in there. But they added X to both sides. So <clears throat> they, for your choices of these four choices, did they add to one side? Nope, they added to both sides. So that would be the answer. They didn't multiply. They just added to both sides. Now, that's portion one of that. Then... Portion two is basically what they're saying here. It says, based on the previous answer, are the equations equivalent? In other words, do they have the same solution? What you can think about is just, is this a typical math move to, if you add something to one side, do you add something to the other side? And yes, this is typically how you would solve it. So if that's typically how you would solve it, the answer is yes, that is, they are equivalent. If it wasn't something they did correct, then you would say no. So let's take a look at option number two here, question number two. In this one, take a moment to look. What did they do from to get from equation A to equation B? Well, let's see. This side's the same. This side, they're just, basically what they did is they added a two. You'll notice on the left side, they added two. On the right side, they did nothing. So think about that algebraically. Is that a legal move? And, and no, you can't do that. But... So what they did is they added or subtracted a quantity to one side only. That is what they did. That doesn't mean it was the right thing to do, but that's what they did in this case. So basically, will you have an equivalent equation, or is that a legal math move? And the answer in this case is no, it's not. So not a real difficult one. You're looking, what did they do to get from equation A to equation B? And then B answering the question, is that a typical legal math move that you would find us doing? So that's all I got for you guys. It's pretty easy today. Have a great one, and uh, you have a quiz tomorrow. Bye-bye.